In 1989, Francis Fukuyama said that liberal capitalist democracies were the end of history. But no, events keep happening, some of them very bad. So Fukuyama was mistaken. Nah, dead wrong. Of course Fukuyama wasn't so stupid as to believe that history would end in some kind of literal sense, that all political battles would end and nothing more would happen. His point was that in the 20th century we learned that no other system could produce wealth and dignity better than liberal capitalist democracies. So we can't go forward from freedom, but we could certainly go backwards. He wrote himself in this book that he feared that there is a risk that we would go back into history with all its wars, injustice and revolution. Fukuyama worried that freedom and wealth wouldn't be enough because people also search for meaning, identity and respect. For example, he feared the return of a reactionary right, yearning for hierarchies lost in an egalitarian consumerist society. So therefore he thought that there is a risk that we would once again see bloody and pointless prestige battles, only this time with modern weapons. And by the way, when he discussed whether the status-seeking would be content with a comfortable life at the end of history, he happened to mention a certain developer named Donald Trump. I don't agree with all of Fukuyama's analysis, but unlike most people, at least I read him. Hey wait, don't forget to subscribe to our channel here and check out these other videos. And check back next Wednesday for a new Dead Wrong from Free to Choose Network.